Hey guys, so we got in a little bit of this with the last video, but the word disciple means learner, and the word Christian means little Christ, right? And we talked about how that was a little bit of a derogatory term, but I want you to understand one thing from this, and that is the word disciple is a dynamic term. It is a term, a learner, right? It means that there's an active thing. If you're not learning, then you're no longer a disciple, right? That's whenever, you know, like you, you start to look at it and you're like, hmm, okay, well, as soon as you stop being a student, right, you're no longer a student anymore. You stop going to school, you stop, you know, like going to that class, you're no longer a student of that class, and you're no longer a student of that school. In the same way, to be a disciple of Christ, you have to consistently be learning, right? And the thing that makes it kind of funny is a lot of people identify as Christians, and Christians Christian is not a dynamic term. Like, it is a static term. It is, you know, like, basically of Christ, right, is what we kind of, like, hey, yeah, we, you know, said a prayer, you know, we prayed something, we asked Jesus into our heart, we, you know, like, accepted salvation, whatever kind of meaning that it means there, but it's static because it doesn't change, it doesn't shift, it's, it's just there, and I think that it's very telling that Jesus called for us to make disciples, be disciples, to to actively seek out after him and actively be learning about the things of the kingdom. And so I just want to encourage you, are you static? Are you static? Are you stuck being a Christian? Or are you dynamic and you're learning and you're you're seeking after God in that learning ability to be able to know more about who he is. Thanks for taking a minute.